The life of this beloved comedian was filled with laughter on stage, yet shattered by personal struggles. He brought joy to millions through his television program, showcasing a unique blend of slapstick and heartfelt storytelling. While he excelled at making people laugh, behind the scenes, he faced deep sadness, particularly regarding his son. Their relationship was complex, marked by both love and challenges. The writer's own battles with self-doubt and a longing for connection often reflected in his performances, leading audiences to see not just humor, but the pain of a man striving for happiness. This emotional turmoil was a stark contrast to the vibrant characters he portrayed, creating a paradox that made his comedy resonate even more deeply. This classic served not only as entertainment, but also as a reminder of the struggles that can lurk beneath the surface of a cheerful exterior, inviting viewers to ponder the true cost of fame and the heartaches that often accompany a life in the fires of the spotlight. Red Skelton, born Richard Bernard Skelton on July 18, 1913, entered the world in difficult circumstances. His father, a clown in the Hagenbach, and Wallace Circus had passed away before his birth. Red grew up in severe poverty, but maintained a resilient spirit. Despite the challenges he faced early in life, Red Skelton's perseverance and talent would pave the way for a remarkable career in entertainment. Raised in adversity, his childhood experiences would shape the humor and warmth that endeared him to audiences for generations to come. Through his resilience and creativity, Red Skelton would go on to become one of America's most beloved comedians and entertainers. Red Skelton started his show business journey at age 10, refining his skills in various venues like stock companies, tent shows, and vaudeville. By the 1930s, his comedic talent shone through with routines that found humor in everyday life, especially through pantomime. This early career laid the foundation for his future success in the entertainment industry, showcasing his natural gift for making people laugh and bringing joy to audiences worldwide. In 1938, Red Skelton's comedic routine about the peculiar ways people dunk their donuts was featured in the short film The Broadway Buckaroo. He then moved to films with Radio Key Forum Studios, debuting and having a wonderful time, though they did not continue working with him. Red Skelton's talent for comedy shone through early in his film career, showcasing a unique style that would later make him a beloved figure in the entertainment industry. Despite the initial setbacks, Skelton's determination and humor would eventually lead him to great success in the world of film and television. His early experiences in film set the stage for a legendary career that would leave a lasting impact on audiences for generations to come. In 1940, Red Skelton's career advanced when MGM utilized his comedic talents in films like Flight Command and the Dr. Kildare series. His breakthrough role came in Whistling in the Dark, leading to a successful series of whistling films. Skelton's unique style and engaging performances captivated audiences, establishing him as a beloved figure in the entertainment industry. His ability to blend humor with heartwarming storytelling endeared him to fans worldwide, solidifying his legacy as a timeless icon of the silver screen. Throughout the MGM era, Skelton's on-screen charisma and comedic genius shone brightly, earning him a place among the most revered entertainers of his time. His contributions to film and comedy continue to inspire and entertain audiences to this day. Red Skelton faced challenges at MGM, struggling to showcase his full talent. Often relegated to minor roles, he had notable routines in Neptune's Daughter and Lovely to Look At. However, it was bathing beauty where he truly shone. From 1941 to 1953, Red Skelton hosted his own radio series, creating memorable characters like Jun Jun, George Appleby, Sheriff Deadeye, Willie Lump Lump, Cauliflower McPug, Balliflower McPug, Balliflower McPug, Bolivar Shagnesty, and others. Known for his comedic talent and ability to bring characters to life through his voice, Skelton's radio career was a significant part of his entertainment legacy. Through these characters, he captured the hearts of audiences across the nation and solidified his reputation as a versatile and skilled performer in the world of radio broadcasting. After serving in the Army, the writer faced challenges in his post-war film career at MGM, where many of his projects did not achieve the expected success. Despite this, he found a fruitful partnership with Buster Keaton, which proved to be a turning point in his career. Their collaborations, particularly in films like A Southern Yankee in 1948 and The Yellow Cab Man in 1950, showcased a unique blend of their comedic talents. Keaton played a significant role in refining the writer's comedic style and routines, helping to elevate the humor and appeal of these films. 
The synergy between the two comedians allowed for a creative exchange that enhanced their performances and brought a fresh energy to the screen. This collaboration not only revitalized the writer's career, but also left a lasting impact on the comedy genre, demonstrating the power of teamwork in the film industry. The success of these films marked a notable period in his artistic journey, highlighting the importance of collaboration in achieving creative success. Red Skelton, a renowned actor and comedian, showcased his talent in notable film roles. In the classic movie The Fuller Brush Man, he portrayed a door-to-door -door salesman thrust into a thrilling murder mystery. The film's success led to a sequel, cementing Skelton's place in Hollywood. Additionally, he made a memorable cameo in The Fuller Brush Girl alongside the legendary Lucille Ball, leaving audiences delighted with his comedic prowess. Skelton's performances in these films solidified his status as a beloved entertainer of his time. Red Skelton, known for his comedic sketches, transitioned to television with his final screen appearance in The Daring Young Men and their jaunty jalopies. He was beloved on television, especially with early support from Johnny Carson, who later launched his own career. Red Skelton's influence and talent left a lasting impact on the world of comedy. Red Skelton, known for his improvisation, often caused guest stars to break character. Notably, the Rolling Stones made an early TV appearance on his show. However, the writer's personal life was marked by tragedy, with his son Richard Jr. dying of leukemia and his second wife's suicide attempt. In his later years, the writer turned to painting, finding a new passion that allowed him to express his creativity in a different medium. He became particularly known for his clown face series, which resonated with many art lovers and collectors. These artworks gained popularity and sold well in various galleries, showcasing his talent beyond the realm of comedy and television. His ability to evoke joy and laughter through his performances translated into his art, where the whimsical nature of clowns became a central theme. Unfortunately, he passed away on September 17, 1997, due to pneumonia, marking the end of an era for his fans and the entertainment industry. Despite his passing, his legacy continues to thrive through his significant contributions to comedy, television, and art. The impact he made on audiences remains evident, as his work still brings smiles and laughter to many, ensuring that his spirit lives on in the hearts of those who appreciate his artistry. Red Skelton grew up in a poor family in the Midwest. His early exposure to comedy came from listening to vaudeville acts on the radio. Skelton's family life was difficult, and humor became his escape. He would perform for his classmates at school, honing his comedic skills. Skelton credited his teacher, Mistress Delano, for recognizing his talent and encouraging him to pursue comedy. Another key influence was the comedian Ed Wynn, whose performances inspired Skelton and showed him the possibilities of a career in comedy. These early experiences and mentors shaped Skelton's path towards becoming a successful writer and comedian in the entertainment industry. One day, while working as a newspaper cartoonist, Red Skelton filled in for a sick comedian at a local show. As he stepped on stage, the audience erupted in laughter, and he felt a rush of joy and fulfillment. This moment ignited a fire within him, and he realized his true calling was to bring laughter and joy to people through comedy. From that day on, he dedicated himself to honing his craft, drawing inspiration from everyday life, and injecting humor into every situation. With each performance, he felt more alive and connected to his purpose, solidifying his passion for comedy. This pivotal experience propelled him into a successful career in entertainment, where he continued to captivate audiences with his wit and charm. Red Skelton's journey from a newspaper cartoonist to a beloved comedian was fueled by a deep-seated passion for making people smile a passion that all started with that one unforgettable moment on stage. Red Skelton, the writer, faced significant challenges early on in his career. Financial struggles burdened him, making it difficult to pursue his creative endeavors. Additionally, the industry was skeptical of his talent, presenting another obstacle to his success. However, with resilience and determination, Skelton persevered. He found creative solutions to his hurdles, using his wit, and humor to win over audiences and industry professionals alike. Through hard work and ingenuity, he overcame the obstacles in his path, forging a successful career in writing and entertainment. Red Skelton's career had several breakthrough moments that shaped his success. One pivotal turning point was his creation of the iconic character, Freddy the Freeloader, a lovable hobo that endeared him to audiences worldwide. This character showcased Skelton's comedic genius and became a fan favorite, propelling him to stardom. 
Another significant moment in Skelton's career was his Emmy Award-winning television show, The Red Skelton Show. This program not only showcased his remarkable talent for comedy, but also highlighted his ability to connect with audiences on a personal level. Critics praised Skelton's versatility and originality, recognizing him as a true master of his craft. Throughout his career, Skelton collaborated with top-tier performers and writers who lauded his creativity and work ethic. Peers admired his dedication to his craft and his ability to continually evolve as an entertainer. Critics often commended Skelton for his unique blend of humor and heart, noting his knack for touching the lives of his viewers. In conclusion, Red Skelton's career was marked by groundbreaking projects, critical acclaim, and widespread recognition. His ability to connect with audiences through memorable characters and genuine humor solidified his legacy as a beloved entertainer. Red Skelton approached his work with a unique blend of humor and heart. His style was characterized by slapstick comedy and clever wordplay. Skelton's personal experiences, including growing up in a vaudeville family and facing challenges in his early career, shaped his comedic sensibilities. His optimistic worldview and belief in the power of laughter to bring people together were reflected in his work. Skelton's ability to connect with audiences on an emotional level through comedy made him a beloved entertainer. His creative process involved a deep understanding of human nature and a desire to spread joy through his performances. Skelton's enduring legacy lies in his ability to touch the hearts of people through his art. Red Skelton's contributions to comedy and entertainment have left a lasting mark on the industry. Known for his ability to blend humor with heart, he pioneered storytelling techniques that emphasized character-driven sketches and physical comedy. Experts often cite his unique style, which combines slapstick with poignant moments as a major influence on later comedians like Robin Williams and Jim Carrey. His creation of beloved characters such as Clem Kadiddlehopper and Freddy the Freeloader showcased his talent for connecting with audiences through relatable personas. Critics have noted that Skelton's emphasis on clean, family-friendly comedy set a standard in an era where humor often pushed boundaries. He also inspired numerous performers to explore their creativity by embracing character work and narrative in comedy. His legacy continues to resonate, encouraging a new generation of artists to delve into the emotional depths of humor while maintaining a playful spirit. Red Skelton's life outside of his performances was rich with personal values and interests that deeply influenced his work. He believed in the importance of laughter and its power to uplift spirits. This belief drove him to create characters that resonated with people from all walks of life, bringing joy and comfort to audiences during tough times. Skelton was also passionate about art. He spent much of his free time painting. He often used his artistic skills to raise funds for various causes, reflecting his commitment to helping others. Philanthropy was a significant part of his life. He supported various charities, particularly those focused on children and the arts. His dedication to these causes showed his deep empathy and desire to make a difference. Skelton often performed for charitable events, using his talent to bring attention to issues that mattered to him. His warm-hearted nature and commitment to community service left a lasting impact on both his audience and the causes he championed. Reflecting on the legacy of Red Skelton within the industry, one can see his lasting impact on comedy and entertainment. Known for his iconic performances and humor, Skelton's contributions to the field have left a mark on generations of performers. As for envisioning his future contributions, one can imagine that his work will continue to inspire and influence upcoming talents in the industry. For aspiring professionals in the field, Skelton's advice would likely revolve around the importance of staying true to oneself, honing one's craft through hard work and dedication, and always striving to bring joy and laughter to audiences. His example serves as a reminder that dedication, talent, and a genuine love for the art form are key ingredients for success in the entertainment industry. Red Skelton, known for his passion for comedy, brought innovation to the entertainment industry with his unique humor and creativity. His enduring impact can still be felt today through his timeless performances and influence on future entertainers. Skelton's dedication to his craft and perseverance in the face of challenges serve as a powerful reminder of the importance of creativity and tenacity in achieving success. Through his work, he showcased the transformative power of laughter and storytelling leaving a legacy that continues to inspire generations of artists and audiences alike. Red Skelton was a remarkable writer and performer whose work has left a lasting impact on the world of entertainment. 
His unique blend of humor and heart resonated with audiences for decades. Skelton created memorable characters that brought joy and laughter to many, showcasing his talent for storytelling and comedy. His television shows and performances highlighted his ability to connect with people, making them feel seen and understood. The legacy he left behind is not just in the laughter he inspired, but also in the way he approached his craft with sincerity and dedication. As we reflect on his contributions, it is important to consider how his work continues to influence comedians and writers today. We invite you to share your thoughts on Red Skelton's work and legacy in the comments. Your insights are valuable, and we encourage you to like, share, and subscribe for more content that celebrates the creative spirits shaping entertainment.